It, the only requirement is the state, st or state constitutional requirement, that if the city wants to borrow any money for any project, they have to get voter approval. Unless it's in a redevelopment district, and this is in a redevelopment district. That, and because the bonds, the bond covenants will, that's the way the people feel that city officials have gotten around the Constitution. Yes, Your Honor, very much so. I asked the same thing, Your Honor. That's correct, Judge. If, you were, if we want to get into the things that I put in count three in the exhibits, I'll be happy to do so. The city wanted to put it on a ballot. We had a workshop for hours with city council. We had, the problem was the plaintiff and the party in interest, which is voteonthepeer.com, the representatives here, and their leadership were all submitting different questions to city council. In fact, the plaintiff, plaintiff. Judge, I'm just answering your question. No, I say and I respectfully I disagree, Your Honor, with the characterization of what was going on there that day. And, and Judge, I said 20 minutes ago I wasn't going to get into count three because you're right. Under a, uh, under a B6 motion, we shouldn't. But I'm answering your question. That's absolutely correct. They tried to, but when, for example, the plaintiff submitted six different questions, none of which were the actual I've turned the straw poll, that's going to cause a, a reaction. And what were we supposed to do? And, 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 I understand all that. Okay. I understand. I'm, I'm just I'm going back to the one sentence of Mr. Patton in his post memorandum of law that I highlighted because to me it's extremely important. It says the city of St. Petersburg was ready, willing, able, and eager to put a referendum question to vote. Absolutely. And that's really what this petition wants. I mean, I know we're doing all this other legal gobbledygook, but that's really what they want. Why don't we get together and say, let's do it. Okay, there were six questions and nobody agreed on the questions, but they were Let's do it. 